I got started skating. I was at a friend's house and we were riding around his neighborhood. They all had bikes and stuff, and he had a skateboard in the in the garage. And I just pulled it out and started riding, and trying to ollie on the curbs and stuff. Saw a lot of kids doing it, and I enjoyed it. Tony Hawk video games. The very first one, Tony Hawk Pro Skater. I got into that, and then I was just like, man, I kind of actually want to skateboard along with like Rocket Power. Watching that show, and, like I got my first board when I was like 11 or something with my friend. We both got it as Christmas gifts, so we just started picking it up from there. Probably have skated almost every single day since then. It's just something to do. It just like I can't think of anything else besides skating half the time. It's just like I honestly wouldn't know what I'd be doing. I don't even know what I'd be doing if I didn't skateboard. I don't really know where I'd be without it. It's just like an inescapable thing. Like you can't get away from it. It's always on your mind. I used to remember in high school, like all day in class, like I just used to sit and think like all day, like I can't wait to skate, I can't wait to skate. And it's just like all I could think about all day. And then as soon as I got out of school, like run and like grab my board and like try to get to the skate park as soon as possible. It keeps me going that you can always progress. Like certain sports, baseball, you hit a home run. You can't do much better. Skateboarding is always good for progression. It's different than sports, period. Skateboarding, there's no restrictions. Like, you can do whatever you want on skateboarding. It's fine, like, with like other sports, like football and stuff, like, you're always being coached, like, yeah, you learn how to be like in like, a team environment and work together. But like, even with skating, you can work with people, like, figure stuff out, like, ask people questions, like, how to do a certain trick, or like, preferences and stuff. Like, and, like, you don't get the pressure of being, like, let down almost. Say like if you like mess up in like a sport like a play, oh you messed up, like it's all your fault. Like in skateboarding you can like mess up all the time and it won't be your fault. Like, like it doesn't matter like how good you are compared to everyone else because like all skateboarders just accept each other and it's just kind of like your own personal struggle to like get better. Being able to do it yourself and like learn and progress is the best part. Not being like yelled by like your dad or something to like, oh you did it wrong, do that ten times. Yeah, being pushed is always good, but just like, let yourself do what you want to do, basically. Restricted. There's no rules, regulations. There's no coaches that tell you what to do. And then, like nowadays, like since like skateboarding is getting bigger than ever, and like people are actually winning money and actually make a living and fortune off of it, it's just like you see parents like pushing kids and almost like coaching them, and it's just like that's not like the fun part of skateboarding. Just... Everyone wants to go pro, but not really gonna happen. Still do it anyways every day. Love it. Growing up, I always wanted to be a professional skateboarder. It was just like always something that interested me. Uh, and now I'm at the point where, obviously, I'm not going to be a professional skateboarder. It's kind of obvious. But at the same time, like, I haven't even thought for a second about ever stopping because it's not about like going anywhere with it. It's just about what it does for you, like as a person. Half the time I skate now is just like to dick around and have fun. Like I don't even try because I know, like, in my back of my mind, it's just like, yeah, I'm never going anywhere with this but like it's just like a fun thing to do and I'm just like I laugh half the time I'm skating I'm just like goofing off with my friends and just like riding like the simplest things it just helps you realize like a simple piece of wood and four wheels the simplest thing ever it can bring such like an enjoyment out of someone just like a whole new world and like even like just skiing and bombing those is just like a thrill and just fun and just makes you like forget about things you just like think about it all day and you can't stop. And it's just like all day you're just like, I wanna try this trick or like I wanna land this. And like even if you don't, it's still fun. That's what I love. I love just busting my ass all day and landing a trick. It's definitely worth it.
I mean, I've been skateboarding off and on since I was nine, and I'm still skateboarding, and the feeling is still just the same as it was when I first stepped on the board when I was nine. Like, if I do stop, it'll probably still be on my, my mind still, and like, I'd probably still think about it, and be like, I might even give, like, when I have a kid, like, a skateboard just, like, to have up around the house so, like, you can just skate possibly and pick it up like I did. Until the feeling goes away, I'm never going to stop skateboarding, and I don't think the feeling is going to go away anytime soon. Uh, I don't know if it's going to. We'll figure it out when we get there, but for now, I'm not going to stop skateboarding.